Happy Thursday, everybody. Don't forget to save, a.k.a. Sam, back at you guys with another video. Uh, as you guys know, tomorrow is Friday after dark, 7 p.m. Central Standard Time. We're all going to show up. We're going to have fun. Uh, please uh, show up if you, if you can. If you guys don't like fun, don't show up to the Friday stream. But if you like fun then and you want to be one of the cool kids then show up on friday after dark that's all i gotta say so that and uh, uh i appreciate all the comments and likes you guys have been doing uh for me uh smash that like button leave me a comment in the comment section down below it, just leave whatever comment you want i guess uh you know if i show something you like say something or whatever you know so anyway um on to what today's subject is i found some uh these are some game room finds and some stuff I had in my binders, basically. So, we're starting off with an Adventures of Superman number 505. Now, that is one that I've had since I was a kid. And, of course, you got the foily cover. It's kind of damaged. And I will mention on the back, because I wanted to show you guys the back, uh, The Death and Life of Superman. Uh, that's a book I used to have. My dad actually got it for me. And when all my Superman stuff got stolen, that's one of the things that... I lost, so I do want to find a copy of The Death and Life of Superman, because it is some, a book I read as a kid, so there you go, there's that comic book, um, we're going to grab, we're going to stay with the comics for a couple tries here, um, we got a What If, uh, Barbara Ketch had become Ghost Rider, um, nice cover, like it, I don't know much else to say, I like Ghost Rider, so, um, of course I'm going to like that cover, so, that's an awesome comic. Um, here's a comic that I believe I got from our roommate, Karen. And it is the Marvel's uh, Collector's Choice here. We're, we're going to... I'm just going to bring it up here because you probably can't see it there. Marvel's Collector's Choice, X-Men. And this is number two in an explosive two-part series. So this is the second comic book. It's like a miniature thing. I guess it was a promotion for Pizza Hut. And uh, it's X-Men, so, of course, you know, that's something that I held on to, so. All right, so, moving away from comic books, well, actually, you know, we're staying with comic books just for this one more here. This is something you guys that collect comics might appreciate here. You guys remember Wizard? Um, Wizard was a uh, comic book price guide back in the day, and so, uh, you know, you get your, comic, your price guide. It was sort of like a Beckett. This is from November of 94. Uh, 395 uh, American and 535 in Canada for my Canadian friends up there in Can Canada. Um, but yeah, it's got some uh, pretty cool artwork in it. And like I said, if you, you know, it had uh, comics that were coming out and whatnot at the time. And of course, uh, somewhere in here is the price guide. Yep, there we go. Somewhere in there, you get your comic books. Like you say, you got the Death of Superman or my copy that I have of uh, that I showed at the beginning uh, you could look it up in here and find out what is worth in back in 94 um, probably not worth much more today than it was in 94 but it's kind of a, a relic if you want to consider it that so all right moving along this one I told you guys I was in actually in red rum stream last night and uh, they were talking about the Chicago Bulls that is an official game program of the Chicago Bulls, Edition 3, Volume 2. We got Dennis Rodman on the front of there. Um, got Michael Jordan there, of course. Uh, it was back in the Bulls' heyday. Let me see if I can find what year this was. 96-97, uh, I believe, was this year. So, um, if anybody likes that, let me know in the comments section down below. Because, like I said, people were talking about it. I've got one with Scotty Pippen on it too. I think it's still in the game room, game room, I believe. But here, I'll just leave this one up here. Um, but it is what it is. I'll show you guys a couple of more comics I got here, just to round the video out, just to make things a bit solid. But yeah, I really like that cover. Like I said, I got the Pippen one too. So if anybody likes that, leave me a comment. And here's the one I've picked some of this stuff up at like yard sales and whatnot. And here's one I got, and it's a Silver Age, I think it's a Silver Age or Bronze Age, one of the two. Um, it's The Thing and Black Goliath, actually. And my my Thing card, I got my Thing hologram in there. Um, it's the thing I do, if I have a hologram of the character on the comic, I'll, I'll throw the card in there. Um, so, but anyway, yeah, that's a nice comic book that I have. Um, 
I really like that one. Like the cover, like the vintage of it. It's good stuff. Um, so moving along, uh, you guys know I collect the Reign of the Superman, and I have the Cyborg a Superman Reign of the Superman. So I think the only one of those that I'm missing, really, to be honest, is uh, Superboy. Um, is the only one. This I believe is a Cyborg. Yep, that's there. So awesome comic. Like I said, it goes with my collection. I probably should bag and board that um, just because it goes with everything. And continuing along in the reign of the Superman, yes, I, I collected a lot of these. And some of these, yes, I have had since I was a kid, including this one. Probably should bag and board that one as well. Um, I think that's where we're going to round out here. Um, reign of the Superman. I have one with uh, Guy Gardner uh, in, in the last Son of Krypton as well, somewhere around here. So, uh, anyway... Those are my comic books. Uh, like I said, I've had that one since I was uh, since I was just a kid. I've actually had that since whenever it was made, June of '93. So yeah. Anyway, if you guys like the video, leave a like, uh, drop a comment. What was your favorite comic or thing that I showed? Um, like I said, Friday after dark tomorrow, guys. It'll be a blast. We're gonna have fun. So until tomorrow, love your hobby and we'll love you back. Peace.